Hello and welcome back to Tech It with XRX 99X. Now, last time we left off, we left our setup here to condense dark matter overnight, and wow, we have a lot of dark matter now. Um, so yeah, so that is plenty. We can actually 30 should be enough for now. What we're gonna do is create some flying rings and upgrade our setup here to a Mark II setup. So let's go ahead right away. So what I'm gonna do is just mine up all of Actually before we do anything Let me condense some of these feathers so that we can make ourselves a flying ring first of all Okay, I only need five one two three four five Put dark matter back in Okay so what we're first going to do is make ourselves a flying ring. Now a flying ring is called the Swiftful Friendly Gale and it requires four dark matter, one iron band, and one and four feathers. So an iron band is just, let's see, a bucket of lava which I already have from a previously failed episode surrounded by iron and then we go like this and then this and then we get ourselves a flying ring so now as you guys can see it runs off a of fuel source it runs out off of glowstone there's other fuels we can use which we'll build later this episode but not for now and if we double tap space take off our jetpack double tap space as you guys can see we can fly like we are in creative and there's no fall damage but you have to have it on your hot bar see if I put it in there it wouldn't work but you don't have to have it selected. It just has to be in your heart hot bar. So it's a really useful tool. So now we don't have to use a shitty jetpack or anything anymore. So that's awesome. Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm mining up all of our collectors here and relays for a more improved setup with our Mark II collectors, which is made from using the dark matter and um, the dark matter and our previously collected stuff. So I'll throw out this rotten flesh and collect the rest of these relays and then we'll be good. So I think I have enough of everything, probably. I'll turn the last of the school stone. There we go, that should be good. Okay. So now, what we'll do, sorry, is we'll go into our crafting table, get, first we'll upgrade our collectors. So basically what it is is just dark matter on top of the collectors, and then with a U of glowstone. There we go, and we should get 17 of those. Okay. Now for the relays, same thing except with obsidian. Come on. Oh god, oh god. Oh. Okay. So now, I'll surround our condenser with the relays put the collectors under that um that's not right is it i guess that is and then this and surround these I think that's right. That should be. There 
There we go. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is just for some... Um, I'm, what I'm going to do is I will put in some Mobius fuel. I don't know if I have any with me at the moment. I can make some really fast, so... So... What I'm going to do is make f four Kleinstar ions. Now, basically what a Kleinstar is, is it's used as fuel for the flying ring instead of the glowstone that you could use. So what it is, is it's just Mobius surrounded by, um, surrounded by a diamond. So it's a pretty easy recipe. So I'm just going to pop this Mobius fuel in and wait for it to create a bunch of that. And then I will bear it back. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so we got 33 Mobius fuel. That should be enough. Um, I think I needed 32. So that is fine. Um, let's go to a safe location onto the roof or something. Okay, so Philosopher's Stone. We're going to make our Klein Star now. So again, this is just a, f a source of fuel for our tools. So we'll make four. And what you do with the four, as I'll show in a second, is you put them in a square, and then you get a more upgraded Kleinstar Zwei. It goes from Dre to Zwei, I think. Or maybe, I, I don't even know. It's like Ein to Zwei to Dre, and yeah. It's a little bit confusing. Okay, so we got plenty of dark matter left, and one thing I may want to do is upgrade our the rest of our dark matter, saving one of course, into red matter. So here, let me, what I'm going to do here is create ourself a Aeternalis fuel, because that is used in the process of making dark matter so I'll take four Mobius to get an Aeternalis plop that in there mm. I think I need six there we go, six. All right, perfect. And then we're gonna make our first red matter here already, which is excellent. Okay, so I believe the recipe goes like three Aeternalis on the top and bottom, and then three dark matter, and then we get a red matter. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is upgrade these Mark twos to Mark three already. So what I'm going to do is put this in here, condense all of our, oh my gosh, we had enough actually, wow, perfect. Okay, so now that we have more than 22 red matter, what we're going to do is actually already change these Mark IIs to Mark threes, the max upgrade already, that fast. and then. But we only have one dark matter left, but that is okay because it is completely worth it once we do this. So what we're going to do again is mine these up. Just think, that quickly we went up from a Mark II to a Mark III, or Mark I to Mark III in like 10 minutes. And that is just from us running the Mark I setup overnight and getting a lot of dark matter. This thing is amazing once you get it fully upgraded. I will show you guys. Okay, so we can drop the feather and something else as well. Um, although, did I pick it up? I guess I did. Wonder why I have 18 collectors. That's weird. Uh, hmm. That's weird. Okay. 
We could use it for condensing, I guess. Okay, so now, what we'll do is with our fresh new red matter, we'll save one, of course. Oh, shit. Hold on. Um, you know what? I'm gonna have to make some more glowstone. <laughs> That's enough. Um, okay, so. Okay, I'm gonna need some more. So what I'll do... I'll have to waste one of our red matters here or something. Because I, I really don't want to... Oh my god. Okay. That's more than enough we'll ever need. Um... But that back in is that right yeah okay okay so now back to where we were I'm also gonna need some more obsidian but that is not a problem at all oh shit it's in the condenser okay now with this leftover EMC I just need a stack put one okay Back to the point. Upgrading our machines. Okay. So we'll take our 17 collectors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Perfect. Okay. And then we'll take our relays. Perfect. There we go. So now we got our fully upgraded Mark 3 collectors and Mark 3 relays. So we'll place these around the condenser. We've gotten a lot of equivalent exchange stuff done already. It's awesome. I can't believe how quick we do we did that. I think that's record time that I've ever gotten a full setup like this. Okay, there we go. So now, if we put a diamond in there, it's just taking that. Um, that's just taking the, it's actually, I kind of want to delete that. Hmm, I guess I can't. Sometimes the delete button disappears, it's kind of annoying. But as you guys can see, it's creating diamonds very fast. Um, I think that's just maybe from the obsidian though. I don't know, let's, let's check. We'll just throw it out. Crap, this is giving it back to me. Yeah, as you guys can see, that's completely the normal speed that it's creating diamonds at. So that is actually a really good speed that it's creating diamonds at. Watch how fast it creates dark matter also. It's pretty amazing. See that? That is crazy fast. So now, pretty much, I don't think we'll ever need to go mining again after this. Most likely not. Um, let's put in the glowstone block. This is this is completely real. I, I tell you not that I, I like I said before, it is one of the best investments you can make in Tekkit. One of the best. So now 
we got our fully upgraded thing. Our fully upgraded condenser. Let me fix this door real quick because that has been driving me completely crazy. There we go. So yeah, guys, that it, it's that crazy how well it works. It's absolutely crazy how fast it goes. Okay, guys, so yeah, um, we're getting a pretty good uh, thing going on here. What I'm going to do next episode is get a... Hmm, I don't know. I think I'm gonna leave the red mat, the uh, dark matter on again overnight, like I did last time. And then once we get a lot of red, a uh, dark matter made, what we're gonna do is set up a red matter creator that sets up about one red matter per minute. It's amazing. And then after that, we can get involved with red matter tools, red matter, um, just everything red matter. And then we can move back to industrial craft. So, yeah, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, this has been XRX99X with Let's Play Tech It. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.